the world's first Alzheimer's vaccine might be here. Researchers at the University of New Mexico have just announced a groundbreaking vaccine, a one that doesn't just slow Alzheimer's down, they're hoping it may actually prevent it from ever developing. If you're someone who's worried about brain health for you or your family, this is something you probably want to hear. I'm gonna walk you through what this new vaccine is, how it works, and also what stage it's currently at and also what date you might expect it to be released. And this is straight from the studies that I'm looking at. I'm Sarah Jeffries, I'm a registered nurse and clinical nurse educator, and I help people improve their health through evidence-based guidance. And brain health is something that's really close to home for me. I'm married to a retired professional boxer who used to get punched in the head for a living. So as you may know, Alzheimer's has robbed millions of their independence, their memories, their lives, and for years, the medical field has been trying to solve this. But most treatments so far, they focus on managing the symptoms rather than truly fixing the problem. And this new vaccine from the University of New Mexico might just change everything. It focuses on tackling Alzheimer's at the root cause. Before we dive into the vaccine itself and its findings, let's talk about why this is actually so important. Right now, Alzheimer's affects 55 million people worldwide, according to World Health Organization. And that number is expected to double by 2050. Alzheimer's isn't just about a person's memory. It disrupts the person's independence. It totally destroys a person's life. And the heartbreaking thing is, it often progresses quietly and really slowly over time. And it's unnoticed for years. That's why this vaccine is such a powerful idea. Like, imagine stopping the disease before it ever takes hold. This would just be a dream come true, right? Now, let's get into the science part. The vaccine targets something called tau protein. And this is why the vaccine is so exciting. Instead of targeting amyloid beta, which previous vaccines and treatments have focused on, this targets tau protein, a different protein which scientists believe is even more closely linked to memory loss. And you probably didn't know this, but tau naturally exists in the brain. It helps keep the brain cells stable. But in Alzheimer's, tau becomes toxic and it starts to clump together, forming something called tangles inside of the brain. Now these tangles, they disrupt communication between the neurons. And over time, they kill the cells and disrupt parts of the brain that are responsible for memory, decision-making, and a whole lot more. Now this new vaccine teaches the immune system to recognize damaged tau protein, especially a fragment called PT181, and to destroy it before it even forms tangles. And this is huge because it's not just treating the damage, it's preventing it too. The vaccine uses something called a virus-like particle, or VLP for short. This is a harmless structure that mimics a virus and tricks the immune system into thinking that abnormal tau protein is a virus. And then if the tau protein starts to become abnormal, the immune system sees it, learns to attack it, and builds up long-term protection. It's the same approach that's been used successfully for vaccines like HPV and hepatitis B. And this isn't just theory. The vaccine's been tested in genetically engineered mice that have developed Alzheimer's-like symptoms. And the results, well, they were better than expected. In those mice, the vaccine triggered a strong antibody response, cleared up tau buildup, reduced brain shrinkage, and even improved memory performance. Right now, the vaccine is not available to the public because the next step is clinical trials for safety in humans. Now, with this, phase one will include a small group of healthy individuals. They'll be monitored closely to make sure the vaccine is safe and to measure the immune response. And if all goes well, they'll move into larger trials for phase two and phase three, where they'll test how it works for people at risk or already shown signs of Alzheimer's. And this is how all vaccine drugs are developed. It's a slow, careful process, but it's necessary to make sure treatments are safe and effective. If it passes all phases, this could be a true medical breakthrough, the kind we only see once or twice in a generation. You might have heard about other drugs recently approved for Alzheimer's, like this one and this one. These treatments target a different protein called amyloid beta, which forms plaque between brain cells. But these treatments come with very mixed results results, potential side effects like brain swelling or bleeding, and also they come at a very high financial cost. What makes the new vaccine exciting? It targets tau, 
Now, we're not here yet, but fingers crossed, I'm hoping this vaccine can switch Alzheimer's from a life sentence to a preventable disease. And I'm going to be keeping a close eye on this, so make sure you subscribe to my channel for more updates. But one more thing I want to leave you with on brain health. One of the best things anyone can do, anyone, is concentrate on your sleep. While you sleep, your brain clears away tau protein and amyloid beta, two things we've just talked about which cause Alzheimer's. And for some tips on how to sleep better, click here and watch this one, where I give you some interesting facts and tips on how you can get a best night's sleep. Click here.